Everyone loves burgers, and I want to share how to take your burgers to the next level this summer. I'm Chef Gavin with the Certified Angus Beef Brand, and I'll show you how to make a delicious double smash burger that will be the envy of everyone in your neighborhood. First, you have to start with the best ground beef, the Certified Angus Beef Brand. It meets all 10 of the quality standards that the brand's steaks and roasts do. Most importantly, the marbling that it's famous for is just as important in the ground beef. It melts as it cooks and will make your burgers so flavorful. My go-to ground beef is ground chuck. It's 80% lean, 20% fat, and that's the perfect ratio for any great burger. Let's get the beef ready. Because these are going to be smash burgers, I'm not going to make patties. I'm going to roll it into ping pong sized balls. After washing my hands, it's time to make the special sauce. Combine mayonnaise, mustard, grated onion, hot sauce, and a little Worcestershire sauce. My grill is preheated, and as you can see, I have a cast iron griddle on top. You can also use a couple large cast iron pans. Cast iron is great because it can handle the heat of the grill and gives you the smooth surface you need for smashing. I'm going to start by buttering and toasting the buns until they're golden brown, then set them aside. Now for the fun part. Take your meatballs and put them on the griddle. You can hear them start to sizzle, but just wait. Use a large spatula to smash each one down. I like to use a second spatula to give myself some extra leverage as we want to get them about a quarter inch thick. And now it's time to smash the rest of the patties. As they cook, they're forming a really delicious crust on one side. Before flipping, season them with salt and pepper and a spread of special sauce on one side. It's time to flip. That sauce is going to cook into the burgers and give it a really unique flavor. See how nice that crust is and how good those crispy edges look? That makes for next level flavor. Now I'm going to top half the patties with good old American cheese. Nothing melts better. Since these are thin burgers, they're going to cook through pretty quickly. I want to stack a plain patty on top of each of the cheese patties. It's time to finish building the burgers. On the bottom buns, smear some more special sauce, then add shredded lettuce and tomato, then top with the burgers. This classic double smash burger is a great way to take your burger game to the next level.